So I just woke up to this stuff and man, um, it might be one of those where I lose the super fanboy <laughs> card that people be trying to label me. Um, yeah, um, so the Dragon Ball Super Manga Chapter uh, 91 spoilers came out and to give preface, I don't know the translations. I only know a little bit what DVS tweeted out, but um, yeah, um, listen, I, it's really, I don't want to sound like a hypocrite, right? Because I did ask for like retellings, but I asked for retellings of the Dragon Ball superhero movie to fit in with the canon of the manga verse of the anime verse. And this is what I keep telling people because like, why are you power scaling go on beast and all this stuff and all these other things? Because one, because of views more than anything. Um, but two, it's like the anime and manga pick and choose what canons they want to add in. And it's just frustrating now because I was like, okay, maybe they're going to do right because at least in the manga, they had it where Gohan was training throughout the Granola, or not, I mean, not the Granola arc, through the Galactic Patrol arc, so that's Moral Saga. And he didn't stop training at the Universal Survival Saga. And maybe the anime might flip flop it, but no. Torotaro, like he did in Battle of Gods, because in the Battle of Gods manga, Gohan did go ultimate, and his ultimate wasn't base. But then he retconned it for his manga to have ultimate only be base in the term of the power and the moral saga. Now we're back to Gohan needing to transform to go ultimate just like the anime. That's one of the makers I've always had about this manga is that the anime has made better decisions. But people have praised the manga for making like perfected Super Saiyan Blue even though it's just blue with no aura. Just like these weird career decisions that kind of make things more lame. Like having Gohan with no bang or whatever, even though that happened at the end of Z. And now we're at a place where like, we're just doing the exact same thing of the mo uh, of the movie. Like, panel by panel actually. <laughs> like, at least in the anime, when they did like the Battle of Gods Resur Resurrection F retelling, and some of those things, they changed things to make things better. Granted, the anime suffered a Resurrection F because that animation was going through it. But, you know, they added in, like, how they got Super Saiyan Blue, stuff like that. And I'm hoping the same here, like, hoping more explanation for Gohan Beast. But honestly, it just seems like we're going to waste about a damn near a year doing this. Granted, I know I missed out on the uh, Goats and Trunks, the last chapter, where we just got more confirmation that Trunks is going to end up with Mai. If you need to kind of accept that <laughs> at this point. And Goten just getting more confirmation that Goats is always going to be, like, second fiddle to Trunks happened in GT. Well, he got a little bit more shine in GT. I'll give him that. But yeah. But here, like panel per panel, we're just getting Gohan like doing the whole like, oh, like I'm not all the way rusty. When in the manga, it kind of contradicts his character a bit. It, great, it contradicts his character in the anime as well. So I guess it's consistent there. Whatever. But yeah, like then we're going to go from this Gohan design to like less than a few months. He's going to go right back to the no bang design. I actually had that criticism in the movie. So great. I like this new design. You know, I like it. But yeah, and it's not even talking about Krillin losing to a mechanical bee. Granted, it fits in with Piccolo losing to like a, a bee small creature in the Terminal Power <laughs> that people were mad about. But I'm not really too mad about it. Like, he can't go all out against some humans, and he's most likely lost in that way. But, um, yeah, it's complete retelling. Like, draw panel per panel. <laughs> like, ridiculous. Also, um, I released a video, a workout video. I was a short... Please check it out. It's me doing the Jonathan Major says Kane the Conqueror workout. Um, I don't know. I've heard that you guys want to see like workout routines from me a while ago. I tried it out. It hasn't got any views yet. So it'd be nice for y'all to check it out. See if you like it or not. Give you some tips. You'll want like on a little bit slower. Great. It's hard to do that with YouTube shorts. But yeah. But yeah, man. I just It doesn't really make any sense why they just didn't do what they did in the Moro Saga. Which, I still need to make a video talking about how great the Moro Saga was. So that's the Gal Galactic Patrol arc. It's just so much easier saying the Moro Saga. <laughs> but yeah, it's like, they show flashbacks to the Broly movie. Make sure you know it happened. Granted, it's going to happen differently, obviously, because they don't have... It's just... They, it's, it's left to interpretation, even though I wish it wasn't. But like... It's just hard to do retellings in a manga. Cause you got because especially in a monthly manga where you gotta wait so long. <laughs> Man, like oh I Again, I wanted retellings so it could fit each canon better, not to completely copy and contradict everything. I think the only thing that people are gonna be happy about, at least for the Vegeta fans, is that Vegeta is gonna get his like 
like nerf W, I guess, in the canon. <laughs> I guess, but and, and they already showed that they're looking towards Black Frieza, so I don't know how much they're gonna reshow in this chapter, really. Uh, maybe, listen, I'm still hoping to get like a perfected Cell Max, hoping that we get UI Goku versus Ultra Eagle Vegeta or something, but. I, I think that's falling on like deaf ears really. I think it's gonna be exactly like the movie and we're just kind of wasting time just redrawing the best highlights of it. Again, if this happened in the anime, it would at least feel better because we'll get superhero in 2D <laughs> with like, like, like I don't know, like Takahashi or uh, I don't know, <laughs> like Shida animating it. But again, of course, I don't mind Tortoro's art style, but like even some of it look weird. like. Some of the Gamma's face with the Torotaro design just felt weird. Like, it just, for me, it just contradicts the manga's lore with the whole weird Gohan doesn't need to transform you Super Saiyan now. He's going to do exactly what Torotaro didn't want by him going Super Saiyan and using Ultimate as a transformation. <laughs> and all these Torotaro fanboys that was mad at me back in the day are going to finally admit that it's just unnecessary contradiction just to be different. Same with not putting blue Kaioken and all this other stuff and doing this weird using the Kaioken essence when it's just he just just should have fought the anime there in certain aspects really. Um I don't know. It is I feel like it's a miscommunication and Toratos kinda have to just, you know, just accept it, accept that a lot of his lore doesn't fit the anime. That's why I kinda said that the anime lore or what they do with the anime is kinda always oversee what the manga does in a lot of aspects. That's why it's going to suck when they eventually adapt the whole Beerus is still stronger than UI stuff. <laughs> if they do, because the anime does have a little more power than what Torotaro does. Because as you can see, Torotaro just copy. <laughs> That's all he does right now. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comment section down below how y'all feel about this. This is just a just a retelling, but not even really a retelling. It's just like a copy and paste, my brother. <laughs> it's just a copy and paste. Um, let me know if you're going to check out the Jonathan Majors workout challenge I did. If not, it's fine. Uh, I know I got to put a little bit more effort to kind of build up those videos if I want to make it a thing. But, you know, just try to work on some sponsors and stuff, different stuff like that. Um, of course, this is like a slightly unfair because the full chapter is not out. I don't have the translations. But, again, the only change they made was just making Krillin look ridiculous. <laughs> Do you think there's going to be a perfected Cell Max? Do you think we're going to get, like... The non-contradiction of Goku not knowing meditation or being implied as no meditation where literally the last arc he used meditation to go into quote unquote true UI slash UI sign with emotions and those type of things like again we're having a clash of ideas right now okay Tortaro are you going to stand up for the stuff you said or are you going to just go along with the contradictions man like Rosen Balls brother. <laughs> You gotta tell them that, yo, this contradicts what I said in the manga. But no, you already, like, cut down to the to the ultimate Gohan sub being back to a transformation. Are you gonna allow them to act like he didn't use meditation for UI sign, my brother? Or, or true UI, whatever? Who knows, man. But, uh, yeah, we're just gonna have, like, a waste a few months uh, with this superhero stuff. <laughs> uh, again, I want a retelling, but if it doesn't contradict lore, it is contradicting it, in my opinion. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, yes, yeah, Sun T Job Peace. Love you all.